Hey YouTube, Kira Qualia here, bringing you all my Card Fight Vanguard Dragon Tree Invasion Booster Pack opening. Picked up some more of the Dragon Tree Invasion set from Sneak Preview this weekend. It's a really awesome set, introducing the new Dragon Tree Grade 10 deck that can be utilized in any nation you want with all the new support we have, including also different decks for Bruce and a couple other new additional ride lines as well. So let's go ahead and get started to see what I can pull from the packs that I picked up. So start us off. Let's see if we start off strong or, well, right, starting off with a Painkiller Angel, one of the reprints, and an Affectionate Harp Angel. So I believe five of the reprints are like in double rare foiling, and then five of them are in triple rare foiling, because I believe the double rare reprints were only in the English release. The triple rares were in the Japanese release. We have Gravidia Claxton for our double rare. And I also like that they have two different arts for the packs as well. We have Donji and Jinky for Dragon Tree as well. We have Renowned Phalanx and we have Dragon Tree Wretch Bis Iotvus for Stoikea. This is the grade one searcher for the Dragon Tree marker. So that's our first triple rare. Next pack. And let's see. We can continue the triple rare trend. We have Stealth Fiend, Temurahime, and Sylvan Horn Beast, Winzapu. So the double rare Stoikea unit. Let's see if I can maybe pull one of the reprint triggers as well. Did they put them in this set? So the frame rares, double frame rares, two dress secret rare. Rares, the reissue types, and then the token markers. So there are 10 reissue types. Maybe we didn't get the triggers in the English release. I may be wrong there. But we have Affectionate Harp Angel and another Winged Dragon, Periceptera. I don't know. I haven't seen too, too many other openings yet for the English release of this set. But we have Steam Scar, Zargon. And a frame rare clean sweet dragon for Dark States. That's our first frame rare. So just one triple. So let's see how we do. We have prolific oranges and glorious storm dragon for our next double rare. Yeah, definitely just felt like I got a lot of double rares, but there are 20 in the set, so I might not even have pulled all of them from. My last opening, we have Lady Fencer, Quantum Regression, and Sealed Blaze Dragon, Kankashita, or I believe, or Kankashati. It's for Buff Sargra, like an added grade two backup from the deck. That's my first of that that I've ever pulled. Next pack. Love how all the vegetable related cards are for the Granfia deck. And we have Enlightened Age Dragon, another double rare. So far, two triple rares. And next pack. One who pierces transient causality. And pierce equip dragon, Halbados. One of the new prayer dragons for crossover dress. Trying to organize and keep the rares and double rares and commons as bestly separated as I can. Next pack. And See, we have another Temura Hime and Operate Master Freyhet. So with this one, I see Welstra in the name. So you have Vanguard with Welstra and it's card named Soul Blast 2. Choose a product from your Aura Zone and Operate. So it's an Operate card and I believe it's also a uh, Searcher. So it can be like an additional Searcher for some other decks as well. So it looks like I'm getting some new Triple Rares at least from all of these also. Next pack. And... We have one who pierces transient causality and clean sweep dragon, the double rare version this time. And let's see what we get from this one. We have, oh, detonation monster bobble mine. So one of the reprints and farm and pumpkin for the Granfia deck. So we pulled two reprints so far, the painkiller and the bobble mine, which is bobble mine definitely another good one. 
And we have Clad in Prayer and Prison Luring Lamp, two orders from the same pack. We have Crystallized Dragon and Galactic Bee Hero Bold Salos for the Hero deck. Narcissist Noble for Stoikea and Disruption Strategy Kill Shroud. Feels like I'm due for another triple rare soon. Let's see, we have Magic, Auspicious Signs, Tataril, and nope, Staddle for the two rare pack. And Burrow Mushrooms and Assault Flight Carrier, Lubetz. All right, we're in a rare slump. Let's see if we can get another foil soon. Preferably a triple rare or higher. You have to say that higher part, you won't pull anything else. Knight of Vanquished Bow, Svilt for our double rare. Still got a good number of packs left out, so let's see. And we have Narcissus Noble. And Decisive Heavenly Axe, Del there for Bastion. And let's see what this one gives us. We have Prison Luring Lamp and Tier Knight Ariante for Flagbird. It's uh, uh, just calls a grade three from the drop zone. That's pretty good because you definitely have a big lineup of grade threes to use in Flagbird, that's for sure. We have Green Scaled Flame Knight Staddle and Knight of uh, Plowing Dolbre for Rebel Dress. I've been going back and forth. No, it doesn't look like they're back and forth for each pack, but felt like that for a second. Prolific Oranges and Kit's Peak Griffin. I believe like, that's for the new Dark States deck because it works with having critical triggers in your bind zone. We pull that card next. Is that our next foil we're gonna pull? There's a plant token, uh, quantum regression, and crystallized dragon. We have self-aware spring source Aqua and Azul Wild Flame Fernardio. Looks like Barrow Magnus support. What we can get from this one. There's the Griffo Sid, the starter for Dragon Tree. We have Disruption Strategy, Kill Shroud, and Diablos, Vimance, Bruce, Triple Rare, another good Triple Rare to pull. A good number of people who are hyped for the Bruce stack and all of the Diablos support you can run with it. We have Burrow Mushrooms and Dragon Tree, Wretch Lloyd, Ikear Rizu, or Axier Youth for Broadgate. So two triple rares back to back. Very nice. Next pack. And we have Magic of Auspicious Signs, Tataril, and Yalthin, Ehalton Vogel for Broadgate. I'll do a pack count after I open this one. Let's see. And we have Steam Scar Zargon and Blue Dester Skyrender Avant Garda. Another triple rare. Very nice. All right. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen 18 left. And you know what? We're going to see how the rest of my luck will play fair if we. Organize how many packs we have left. So one, two, I had 18, I believe. So eight Donji and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten Jinky. So we're going to open him first and save the rest of the Donji packs for last. And we'll see where I get better pulls from, from which pack do I pull better. Uh, Salt Flight Carrier, Lubetzel, and Hunting Gatling Storm, uh, Furious. So we'll put them aside for now. I know we have 10 more packs, but let's just give Donji that handicap. We'll see who pulls better. We have Clad in Prayer and a frame rare. I could barely tell this was a frame rare, which is how much was going on in the art, but Desolate Spark Dragon. All right, so, so far, 
Jinky Mukai is going strong with his foil pulls. We have Renowned Phalanx. And, yep, a frame rare for Affectionate Harp Angel. I think all the luck might be with Jinky. Let's see. Pack number four from him. And we have, oh, the triple rare Cardinal Draco Masaria. And a Lady Fencer of Quantum Regression. So he had one of the triple rare reprint cards with his lineup. And it's going strong with him so far. We have Oaqua and Ron Ron Orange Green for a double rare. So he hasn't had any two rare packs yet. I think Donji might have lost this one. We'll see. Nope, I thought that had texture for a second, but nope. We have Farmin Pumpkin and Sylvan Horned Beast Goal Dote. So that's uh, for Magnolia. With four packs remaining, including this one. And he hasn't missed a foil yet. Let's see. We have Farmin Pumpkin and Dragon Tree Wretch Draco Batacall for our triple rare. Yeah, he's, I think Donji might have lost this one. I know we had 10 packs for the Jinky Mukai, but he's just been consistently pulling foils from his packs. And look at that, we have Strike Equip Dragon, Stragalia, another triple rare, with two packs left for Jinky. Let's see. And we have Disruption Strategy Kill Shroud and Prolific Oranges for our, for, oh my goodness, we haven't missed one <laughs> off of all 10. All right, last pack, let's see. For Jinky, at least. We end his with, yep, we saved all the luck right up till the end because we had two rares for him. So from just him alone, we were able to pull a good number of foils. Where are some of the trash here? And then we'll move on to Donji's final pack. So he's got eight packs to show that he has the luck for pulling. We're going to start off strong, start off weak. Let's see. We have Direful Charmaine and Narcissus Noble. All right, so it's a two rare pack, but they were both triggers. Donji's trying here. Let's see. Next pack. We have Spurring Maiden Elenia. So it's a reprint and another heal trigger with an ability. Six packs left for him. Let's see. We have... Uh, Magic of Auspicious Signs, Tartaril, and Desolate Spark Dragon, but I think we actually pulled a frame rare version from Jinky's packs. Five packs left. Let's see. We have an another Charmaine and Diablo Snuckler Jamil. For okay, so that's pretty fitting for Donji, and I, I think it's also funny as I knock over the common pile that got too big. Let me pick up all those so I don't lose any of the cards in the common pile as well that we pulled all of the heals for Dark States from Donji's pack so far. That is pretty funny. All right, four packs left. Let's see. We pull, I want to see the Dragon Tree triple rare. Let me see real quick. What's this one going to be? Prison Luring Lamp and Dragon Tree Wretch Solda Sakab. I'm going to do a triple rare count as well. From Jinkies, we pulled one, two, three, not including the reprint. And then from the packs beforehand, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we pulled ten. So maybe we have eleven. So maybe we have one more triple rare left to pull. One or two. I'm not sure. Let's see here. We have Burrow Mushrooms and Dragon Tree Wretch Demon Shredder, or for the Dark States version of the Searcher. All right, two packs remaining. Let's see if we have anything left to pull. We have Transient Causality and a Frame Rare Enlightened Age Dragon. All right, Don, this is your final pack. Make it count, otherwise I think uh, Jinky Mukai might have won it with his packs. And for the final one, we have Green Scaled Flame Knight Staddle and Disruption Strategy Kill Shroud. So we did get a good number of frame rares from all the packs.
But I think we did pretty well with the pulls again. Uh, sadly, no double frame rare this time around, but I hope you all enjoyed the opening. And as always, until next time, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And Kira Qualia out.